Forza Horizon 3 is an open world driving game where you go and you can race around with your friends. There's a variety of cars in the game and they're all pretty good. Some of my favorites have to be the Conseg 1 or the Ford Fiesta 1981 edition. But you can, you know, decide your favorites if you get the game. It is a fantastic game though, the graphics are amazing, especially in 4K on the Xbox One S here. And I've run into really no glitches at all this entire time playing this game. It is just a flawless game. I have a few complaints about it though. Uh, every time you spawn in, like from the garages and stuff, you just get blasted with notifications that are like, Oh, it's Forza Son! Blah, 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 blah! And it's a little bit overwhelming and it's like, whoa! Yeah, it, I, the graphics are amazing. I mean, there is almost no bugs. Just, just some, you know, this, those complaints, but um, the game is just fantastic. The map is huge, as you can see here, is absolutely massive. There's different festivals to collect. There's different races to do. There's an online mode. I, I played that for a little while, but I don't really play it that much. Um, there's tons of cars. You get tons of money. You race around, get credits. You can do bucket lists. You can do fan events. You're the, the boss of your own Forza, you know, festival. If you ever played it in the Forza 2 or Forza 1, then you know how cool Forza festivals are. And Forza Horizon 4 is actually coming out pretty soon, so we shall see about that game. I, I don't really have high hopes for it because um, the only, comp well, the second point complaint I really, really have about this game is it's in Australia, which there's nothing wrong with Australia. It's a good country and all, but they drive on the wrong side of the road since I'm an American. And it is quite annoying when I'm doing races. I, you know, I'm used to driving on this side of the road, but you know, I don't want to slam into some little minivan driving down the road at two miles per hour, so it is pretty annoying. And Forza Horizon 4 is taking place in the UK, so yet again, it's going to be on the wrong side of the road. And then they come back to the US so I can actually, like, you know, be in my home turf, I guess. See, that's what I'm talking about, vans like that. Anyways, yeah, guys, this game is fantastic. I totally recommend it. On the Presto meter, I would give it a 9.7. It is fantastic, and you should definitely buy it.